everyone welcome to my channel and welcome to today's uh, video now take a look at what I have here here I have a skin firming skin tightening remedy this remedy will help to plump the skin up it will help to reduce wrinkles on fine lines like on your forehead your jawline and even your laugh lines this is also good to use under your eyes is good for your sagging neck and is also good for the decollete as a matter of fact you can use this remedy all over your body now what is so special about this remedy this remedy contain castor oil and guys mm, mm, the smell is not that great at all. However, guys, you could deal with this smell because of what it can do to the skin. Castor oil has been known to help the skin to look younger and firmer, known to help to clear hyperpigmentation, known to give the skin a natural glow. And because of that, guys, it acts similar to retinol on the skin. And that is why they're calling this now a nature Botox what is this nature Botox about is because when you use castor oil on the skin it helps to plump the skin up and I'm just gonna show you a quick demonstration right here with this remedy guys let me just take a little of the remedy just a little bit take a look and I'm just gonna dab it there let me make sure you see that I'm putting it that's too much but I'm putting it anyway that's the remedy right there in my laugh lines and look at this guys this is how fast and effective this remedy works on the skin before I start take a look at my laugh lines this is one here and this is the other one as a matter of fact this one is deeper than this one so that's why we're using this one so I'm placing a little bit of this remedy in my laugh line just explain to you why they're calling castor oil nature Botox and how well it works on the skin so I'm just lifting right now so keep looking guys and I'm going in my laugh lines and I'm massaging it up like this and I'm just doing this for a few seconds now but you could do this for about you know a minute or so but take a look at this <laughs> come on guys really take a look at this This is what I'm talking about, okay? You can see it for yourself. This is not no trick, no nothing. This is raw, uncut. Look at that. This is Kiesto oil mixed with some amazing ingredients that is gonna help your skin to look years younger. Just imagine, I just applied, look up, look at the cheeks going up. I just applied this on my skin just now. But take a look and just imagine using this for about a six week on the skin. Help to clear the skin of pigmentation. Look at my skin, guys, at my age. Come on now, come on now. Look at my skin. And this is also good to use under your eyes if you have on the eye wrinkle dry on the eyes and even eye bags and puffy eyes castor oil Jamaican black castor oil guys is the way to go so in this video I am going to show you how to make this remedy and also I'm going to tell you about all the ingredients we're using this using in this and how to get the best result for your skin so if you're looking for younger looking skin if you're looking for firmer looking skin if you're looking for clear radiant glass like skin follow me to the kitchen I'm going to share the full detail detailed recipe with you and at the end I'll show a live demonstration how to use it on the skin now our first ingredient is gonna be aloe vera gel for this recipe if you have fresh aloe vera uh, go ahead and use it in the recipe so what we're gonna do we are gonna make a base and we're gonna take about a tablespoon of the aloe vera gel Add into the bowl and I'm gonna mix this aloe you do not have to but I'm gonna mix it so I'm gonna mix my green aloe with some pink aloe so I'm using one tablespoon of the green aloe and a teaspoon of the pink aloe vera gel now we're gonna mix the two together mixing pink and green aloe we're making a natural Botox remedy so we're mixing and we're mixing well now when you use aloe on the skin it helps to moisturize and it also helps to repair the skin it gives the skin a fresh look and it also helps to relieve a dryness and roughness from the skin leaving the skin moisturized 
it is good for sunburn skin it is good for acne prone skin and another thing I love about aloe vera is that it also have to reduce wrinkles and also prevent wrinkles and fine lines on the skin now remember as I said for this recipe you can choose to use the store-bought like I'm using here or you can choose to use the fresh aloe vera in the recipe now let's move on to my second ingredient and um, take a look at this guys this is our main ingredient right now this is castor oil now this is not just castor oil it is the Jamaican black castor oil now when it comes on to castor oil guys this have so many benefit a lot of therapeutic benefit now medicinal benefits also which we won't get into for this video however when it comes on to using castor oil topically on the skin it is now known as nature Botox that is because it have to plump the skin up it have to boost collagen and elastin in the skin but another thing about this castor oil is that castor oil have to clear hyperpigmentation if you have eczema if you have itchy skin if your skin is just looking dull if you're just looking for a pick me up this is it right here rich in rinsalilic acid another thing I want to tell you about this castor oil is that rinsalilic acid is released when the castor beans are roast if the castor beans are not roast that's not gonna be released so that is why we go for the roasted now there's some nuts out there that you know don't need to be roasted for it to be effective while some have to castor oil is one of those that is why you find that the black castor oil is more stronger than the white castor oil so this is good for regrowing your hair guys I use this in my hair I use this on my lashes I use this on my brows I use it on my stretch marks I use it all over the body As, but when it comes on to the fragrance it's not all that so what I'm doing today I'm making this for the face but this you can double up and make for the body to get the full benefits of this castor oil and it's so strong look at that look at this how strong this is you do not need a lot so all I'm using in this is one teaspoon I don't know why I didn't share this with you all before just one teaspoon of the castor oil when we make the Chichi Beauty skincare products we had castor oil to some of it because as I said it's one of my foundation ingredient that I grew up with and I strongly believe nowadays people are more on to how amazing this castor oil is so we are mixing aloe vera and castor oil and these are two major ingredients for your skin so mix and mix well now we're not gonna stop there we're gonna add just a few more ingredients to this and not a lot just to kick it up a notch and one such ingredient is gonna be no because the castor oil is more on the thicker side I am gonna use Use a carrier oil to kind of dilute this a little bit so I'm gonna reach for one of my favorite oil and that is some pomegranate seed oil if you do not have pomegranate seed oil use the oil you have we're not using a lot of the pomegranate seed pomegranate seed oil is rich in a vitamin C a vitamin E and it also have to lighten and brighten the skin since it's a carrier oil we're using two teaspoons of the pomegranate seed oil adding this to this amazing mixture so we have the aloe vera gel that's going to lighten and brighten the skin we have the castor oil that's going to boost collagen and elastin going to get rid of acne going to get rid of blackheads whitehead and get rid of the wrinkles and the fine lines and now we add the pomegranate seed oil which is going to help to lighten and brighten the skin and also reduce wrinkles and fine lines making this a powerful a really really powerful facial moisturizer for not only your face your neck and decollete but all over the body and this is it right here this is it guys just a three ingredient castor oil aloe vera gel and pomegranate seed oil you can choose to add a little bit of a vitamin E to this mixture now let's reach for the storage jar And we're just gonna pour this in a 
if you have stretch marks you can also use this on your stretch marks if you have dark neck you can use this and this is it here here it is nature's botox you are going to use this all over so don't go away let me show you how to use this on the skin for best result no need to store this in the refrigerator store it on the countertop and you can use this on your skin am and pm however i prefer to use this on my skin pm you're applying this to clean skin you can also choose to use your facial toner on the skin when I put it on my forehead, I like to do it like this because I'm just lifting, lifting, lifting. When I do it in my jawline, I like to just lift, 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 lift. And note at the beginning of the video, we showed a before and after demonstration. And guys, when I do it on my jawline, I am just lifting, lifting, lifting. And oh my goodness, I'm smelling the castor oil, but that is okay. And take a look, guys, look at that. Oh my goodness. And I'm just applying it. Now let's go down on the neck and decollete. And we're lifting, we're lifting, we're lifting. And you're gonna do this daily for at least six weeks, guys. And then come back and leave your comment thank you so much for watching don't forget to like comment and if you're interested in more videos using castor oil this is one right here and this is another one go ahead and watch these two videos if you have not yet subscribed this is your time guys subscribe to the channel and guess what also share this video thank you so much and I'll see you in my next video bye bye